when asked the following, what would you recommend for someone who experiences adrenal surges after eating certain foods which are accompanied by anxiety and fear? It's also interspersed with periods of chronic fatigue, and I am an overall organic vegan transitioning to the Hippocrates program, but still consume a fair amount of fruit. Well, I mean, I think that you just gave yourself the right answer at the end. You're taking sugar, and sugar affects the hormones like nothing affects the hormones. Now, let's explain what hormones are, what that has to do with adrenal fatigue and histamine activity, et cetera. You have this very sophisticated chemical system in your body. You know, we scientists call them biochemistry. Big deal. What it really is is hormones, that, and their language is, is a chemistry. And that chemistry also in part part of the language is histamine. Now, when you have a reaction to what you've eaten, the histamine starts to pour out and activate the hormones, and all at once, boom, voila, the adrenal gland starts to overactivate or in some cases underactivate. That immediately provokes emotional feelings and sensation because, again, they provoke the neurons in the brain to do odd things, brain cells that make you think and make you understand and make you feel and all the emotion, as well as other cells in the body. So what, this isn't an odd thing that happens to you. What you need to do is make yourself strong, slow but sure, get off the things like sugar that are gonna provoke that, make sure you're eating a lot of protein in your diet via sprouts, be it algae, sea vegetables, etc., etc., etc. Make sure that you're spreading them out, as I said to the young lady trying to get over sugar addiction, throughout the day. Not only in this particular case to pacify the sugar desire, but also to make the hormones balance. In some cases like yours, if you could find a very good and well-experienced bioidentical hormone doctor, she or he may guide you very rapidly through this process. But make sure you're also doing aerobic exercise. A lot of these uh, feelings of depression and anxiety come because of a lack of oxygenation, which also carry the chemistry well in the neuron function and put additional uh, electromagnetic frequency there so that you don't feel that anxiety, that feeling, oh my God, oh my God, I'm hyperactive, I don't know what I'm doing. It pacifies it, aerobic exercise does. 